A state of emergency is in effect for parts of New Jersey as residents are now waking up to their neighborhoods just torn apart after devastating floods ripped through the area. PIX 11's Christian Benavides is live in Little Falls, one of the hardest hit areas. Christian, good morning. Yeah, guys, and take a look. Good morning. We see people's personal belongings out on the street. I want you to take a look at this sidewalk just filled with people's personal belongings after those devastating floods. We know those flash floods picked up vehicles and it wiped away this entire neighborhood. Governor Phil Murphy declaring a state of emergency after those powerful storms left residents without a home. The entire state now bracing for what could come next. This morning, Entire neighborhoods in the Garden State are digging out and desperately trying to get back to normal. After massive flooding left hundreds of homes underwater. Just look at these images from above Brick Township, New Jersey in Ocean County near the Jersey Shore. And look at these cars that got swept up in the flash floods in Little Falls as roads turned into rivers. The banks of the Peckman River cresting and causing widespread damage. This woman describing how the water rushed in. Her entire family had to be rescued. It was just so quick. It was very fast, no time to react. But these are all our cars. They were in our driveway lined up. And when the flash flood came, it lifted everything. And then as the waters receded, just plopped it down as you see it here. Governor Phil Murphy surveying the damage after some residents say they lost everything. One week into my move, I'm, I'm, I'm basically home, I'm going to be homeless in two weeks. Everything I own from my a kid is gone. All my baseball cards, every, everything. I don't have anything left. The governor saying he will explore all possibilities to help out residents who were affected. I promise uh, the mayors and the legislators and members of council and most importantly the members of this community, we're going to look at every available option. And you see those flashing lights, police blocking off the neighborhood while the cleanup takes place. Rain in the forecast for today, and it's unclear how much longer this cleanup will take. We're live in Little Falls, New Jersey. I'm Cristian Benavides, PIX11 News. Cristian, thank you. On to dramatic video out of Pennsylvania.